mid game and being Jay and that we're getting caught out. If you can take this a little bit slower and set up once more, for, or actually find set up for those fights, I think you'll be in an okay spot. It's kind of the, the game one first for them. Although I still say last game was slightly different for them, simply because you end up. Oh, hang on, Levi. Levi got caught out a couple of times last time, and he's caught out again. Bean J and Glory trying to answer it, and it will be Bean J to get first camp here in game number two. It felt like Team Wales was starting to find the advantage as uh, all out once again from Sparta. He goes back in onto the oh, counter strike. No. He's just going to oh, kill him. No, Palin tried to move up to turn the match. <laughs> the feed us out loud. <laughs> yeah, he said the inner thought out loud, but uh, oh, yeah. Go for a dive in the mid lane. That is going to be Katy going down. Glory to pick up the kill. Nice bit of coordination. The route is Artemis keeping himself alive with that cleanse. Now Katy once again. Flash still available, but I mean, where are you going to flash to there? Glory and Bean J. Do have the Rift out in Artemis' back pocket. Means we need to keep our eyes on where Artemis is positioned because as he moves up towards his top side, with uh, both members of Gam. The, uh, you're really far forward, but so is apparently Levi caught out on the top side of the plate. I thought that was BS overstepping, just like game number one. But I'm, I'm proven wrong. Team Wales finding these advantages once again. All over the wall. On to Katty. Bean J. Absolutely shredding the health by here as Glory flies in as well. Trying to deny the flash here. Ignite. Burning away. The first, first strike, strike is there. Katty. A lot of damage coming out. It's not an interaction you see often, is it? The uh, first strike proc off of the Leandris. But here we go. Combo onto Pallet. J trying to chase it up as well. They don't want to go too far forwards. Katy is here trying to punish, and it's a great kick from Levi to turn the fight. Katy the one to go down, though. Team Wales still a pod ahead in this one. Slater versus Artemis. Not out of the map. I don't know, though, if what Team Wales want to try and achieve Hang here. On. They're in a bit of a weird spot. Oh, he's gone quite deep for this one, but the rest of the team is on the way. Slater in trouble. Levi jumps to his teammate, already low on HP and force splash. Pallet buying space for his team as in goes Artemis in the 1v3. Gets out of his life. Catty chasing him, forces the flash from Artemis, but it's one kill. Home to Pallet so far. Catty cannot escape either. And Glory happy to chase for this one. Wants an extra kill onto his opposite man. He's burning. Catty is burning. Beer finishes him off. Shush. This one out. They've got the Red Bull. Red Bull and power play on their side. DJ. A little dicey with it. And BJ was one of the uh, repeat offenders in game number one. Overstepping, getting caught out. Him and Mia both. Both of them now deathless in game two. Feels like the coaching staff had a serious word with those two players. As Sparta zoning the enemy squad away. Dragon down. That's Sol. Bia gets a great crash down onto the back line. And Gamma gone before the fight's even begun. Levi gets one on the backside, but it's nowhere near enough. Bean J finishing them off as he can dive forwards towards Katy. He's not getting anywhere. It's an ace. A minute and a half. Until the Baron comes back onto the map. BJ actually ults out on this one, but Pallet has gone too deep. Stunned up the reset on BJ's ult as well as Artemis. Doesn't have a lot of mana to fly in with, but he does have a blue buff. W's flying in at this point as Sparta just goes for the dive, pulls the enemy jungler back into the fray as BJ going further in on this one. It's another pick as Sparta, the absolute man of the hour for Team Wales right here decimating the laning phase and finding these moments in the late game. And now finding a second inhibitor for Team Wales. BJ started on the bot one, but said, what are we doing? This is the end. This is going to be a Team Wales victory. Should be able to finish it off now. First Nexus turret low. Katy on the Victor Slater on the Zaya. They've got to make magic happen to stay in this one. It's a good stun from Kiaya, but a stun is all they will find. Pallet goes down. The Nexus will fall. And Team Wales, they show us why they were the second seed out from the VCS. And more importantly, why they were the first seed.